So I want to talk a little bit about why sometimes your marketing efforts don't work. And all the time, it's not that you have a bad concept or, or your branding is not working for you. What I find is that it has to be all about alignment and you have to be really consciously aware of how you're doing what you're doing and, and when you're doing it uh, versus whether it's the right thing or the wrong thing to do. Sometimes it's just all about timing because when you can sync up with your right marketing timing and be able to show up when the fish are biting, so to speak, um, you know, for your market, they'll be able to, your tribe, they'll be able to connect to you. So that I see this often where there's a lot of autopilot uh, marketing and, and just people did putting themselves out there, but the intention uh, around it is not really aligned. And so another thing that I know to be true is that your marketing vibes have to be uh, intact. So vibrational marketing really is going to trump everything because that's where your full alignment is there. But a lot of times people think, oh, the vibrational stuff, that's kind of woo-woo, you know, and, and everything, which is, which is not true. Obviously, there, I mean, there can be an aspect of that. But what I'm speaking about from, from the business aspect is that it's where you're getting out. It is, it is the vibe. And what are people picking up on in, in terms of that vibe? And so, you know, I talk a lot about being intentional. And this is just one of those areas that if you don't actually be intentional, you don't... Um, allow a higher level of consciousness to come in to, to guide you and yeah you, you're just going to suffer you're going to suffer in, in your marketing and you're never going to get the result that that you desire and so making the mistake of thinking that something like your vibe isn't that it's not that deep it may seem subtle but it's very significant a lot of times it's things that people think aren't that important they're not that deep they shouldn't really be consideration uh, to certain contexts, those are the very main areas that are costing people royally. And so if you want to shift, you're going to have to align at a higher level, align your vibe, you know, and definitely align a higher level of awareness around how you need to be doing what you're doing. So align with timing and align, align with the vibes. If I, if I had to just preach any sermon, on this today, it would be those two contexts, the alignment with your vib the vibrational alignment and, and then being able to, you know, ultimately, um, you know, be intentional about, um, you know, these areas that I was speaking of. I mean, it's, 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 it's critical. This is something, you know, I could talk about really for days, you know, but you, that timing factor, you have to be intentional about the timing and you have to be intentional about, um, about the vibe. So I really feel like I could just break off into a, a training, you know, around this, but I won't at this point. I just really want to make you aware that you, you're bringing in together everything that I've talked about so far. Yeah, you got to harmonize this thing. So you're, you're vibing and you're timing, <laughs> your vibe and your time, you know, that you, you got to sit with that and be present and, and realize, um, you know, what that looks like for you at this time. What, what is the alignment there? So that's your challenge is, is to be present with how you're vibing and also uh, your timing. And if you sync up with both of those, sometimes even if your copy or your marketing message is not that tight, somehow that vibe and that timing will still work for you. But definitely, if you need to level up your marketing copy, and your marketing message, please do so. And of course, I am here and I have team. Um, we're here to help you do that if you uh, need assistance in that area.